Intel booth and we're talking to Andres, the founder of Bacano Games. Now, VR is all the rage right now and Oculus is really at the forefront of that. Um, now, you guys have created something that you're demoing here today that's really interesting. So talk to us about what you're sharing. Well, here we have the motorbike game, our best-selling game now. Um, we tweak it to make it work for the Oculus Rift and it's basically like the whole new experience from what we have before. Um, just put their the, uh, glasses on and you will experience that you're immersed in a, in a whole new track, driving the, the motorcycle then with the pilot and do it all sorts of tricks. Um, and what now we have it here working on a very powerful Intel computer. Okay, and what has the response been? Well, amazing. <laughs> we didn't expect this. <laughs> A lot of traffic, people, obviously the, the, the Oculus is the one that is attracting people to them with and everyone that sits here and try them on, they just say, wow, I, would, I want to try it, where I can get it. So how does uh, running this game in the Oculus headset using Intel, how does that really uh, optimize the whole experience? Well, the, um, the Oculus is like a second screen to the computer and it requires a special set of um, graphical power, let's say, features. Uh, to, to run well. So talk to me about uh, the graphics here as well. Okay, that computer over there is using Iris integrated graphics and as you can see the graphics are smooth, it provides all the power required for the Oculus to work. So it requires a lot, Intel is able to give it that oomph that it really needs to give you a, a good experience. Set it well, yes. Okay. Alright, well great, thank you so much. Thank you.